At noon, the Christmas season is in full swing, and if you need help getting in the mood, why not stop by the Tupelo Community Theater for It's a Wonderful Life. And joining us now is a TCT veteran and cast member, Bobby Gino. How are you doing, Bobby? All right, how are you? Okay, Good. so tell us about It's a Wonderful Life. For those, I'm sure everyone has seen the movie, but tell us a little bit about it. Uh, it's a Wonderful Life. The play is based on the movie, that's a classic movie that everyone well, I can't say everyone has seen it because we found out that some of our theater people had never watched the movie. I think they're trying to get caught up on that now. <laughs> but it's the story of George Bailey, who thinks his life is just not happening. Nothing's going well. He's ready to give up and he wishes he had never been born. But then through a series of magical events, he finds out that his life really was important and that it did make a difference in the lives of many other people. So it's a, a redemption story kind of about how he discovers we all impact other people. Mm -hmm. Now, what character are you actually playing in the play and how does that differ from 10 years ago? Uh, this time I'm actually playing Henry Potter, who is the meanest man in town and tries to control the town, own the town, take over everything in the town. It's a little bit different than 10 years ago when I played Clarence Oddbody, the angel who came to rescue George Bailey. <laughs> and when you look at both those characters, um, which one do you resonate with? Uh, you might have to ask other people that. <laughs> Some of them would have differing opinions, I'm sure. Uh -huh. uh, Clarence, is just, Clarence is just a good old guy. He just wants to help George and he wants to love everybody and just bring happiness to everyone. Uh, that's a lot of me. I like to see people happy. I like to see them enjoy things. Oh. Uh, try not to be too controlling very often. All right, Bobby, I like that. So now tell us, when does the play open up? Tomorrow night is opening night, Thursday night at 7.30. Then we have a show Friday night at 7.30, Saturday night at 7.30, and also Saturday at two o'clock. I think tickets for tomorrow night are very limited. Uh, Friday and Saturday shows should still have some available, but be sure and call and get on the waiting list. Uh, most of the time we have some people who will purchase tickets and then not be able to come, so we try to get people in from the waiting list. All right, then. Well, thank you so much, Dave. Bobby Gino. And in my book, you're an angel. <laughs> well, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> well, still to come on WTV 9 News at noon. Winter isn't officially here yet, but it's already plenty cold in a lot of areas. And some of